Hello and welcome back. I hope you guys are having a wonderful afternoon. So we're gonna have some really fun comparison. Okay. It's fun. This is ridiculous actually. Do not try this one at home. Because I'm I'm just doing it for fun here. Anyway, so we are going to compare my blade grinder from Amazon. It costs you about 15 bucks. Okay. We're gonna compare the mother of our grinder, the EK43. I mean, I bet you guys seen this grinder at most coffee shops, most uh, high-end specialty coffee shop. They are something else. They're amazing. 98 millimeter flat bar versus this beautiful blade inside. So blade grinder. So I'm going to be using my tricklet this morning. Uh, actually, this afternoon. It's about one o'clock right now. I'm going to be using. You know what? We're going to go splurge ourselves. I usually use about 10 grams. We're going to do 15 grams each. And I'm, uh, so this coffee, uh, had got a story behind this. I got this one about last November. So we did the bracket challenge last November. So it's about six months old, but here's the, it's been, uh, stored in this, uh, vacuum canister. So I can wait to try this. It's going to be spectacular. So this one, let's see here. Let's take uh, take a look at the tasting notes, right? So hold on a second, guys. Put my reading glasses on. Okay, it's, uh, it's uh, uh, coffee from Kuma, Hando roast, Nelling Guzman, uh, light to medium roast. Tasting the cherry pie, almond, and apple. Okay, so. Let's find out. We're gonna get any of the tasting notes using Tricklet. So, you know what? Let's get going. So, I'm gonna be using my fellow stack as a kettle here. And uh, you know what? I like to use the the recycled paper. So, uh, both uh, Tricklet. I'm gonna be using recycled material. The paper inside. Just like that, okay. Just gonna set it. Okay, here we go. I mean, the 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 reason why I love about Tricklet so easy, okay, easy to brew. Kind of like set it and forget it type. I'm just gonna heat up my paper, not the paper, but the vessel server as well. Okay, let's grind some coffee beans. Uh, again, got 15 gram already ready to go. Okay. Wow. I can still smell the tasting notes. Smells actually quite nice. Okay, smells good. Okay. All right. Okay, I'm making a little mess here, but it's okay. The paper is still intact. So it's good. that's a good thing. All right, here we go. So you're going to be using, so a great thing about Trickly is a 15 gram in, uh, more like 1 to 20 to 1 to 22 ratio. So I'm trying to shoot for 15 gram to 30, uh, 300 gram out. Okay, the eel as 300 gram. <coughs> okay, so looking at the, so I'm using the number five as a grinder size. Hopefully you guys can see that. It's pretty fine, okay. So here's the tricky part. I need to mimic. I need to be close to this grinder size on my blade grinder. So that's another reason I start with EK43 first. Put the coffee beans in. Hopefully we're gonna get the similar size, okay? So So I'm going to be a little pulsing right now. Just make sure I get the 
right consistency. So. No, not even close. Okay. I mean, EK42 uses text by what? A couple seconds to grind 15 grams. For this one, yeah, I'm not quite sure yet, but you know, we're gonna get there. Okay. Okay, you know what? It might work, all right? It might work, guys. Okay, here we go. So let's do this. All right, let's brew some coffee. If you are joining us for the first time, welcome to our live streaming, okay? We do a lot of fun stuff here in this channel. Unlike other channels, we do some silly stuff like this. Okay, so, so this is the blade grinder. I got 14.7 gram. Here we go. Uh, 14.8, very close. Is it about? I'm going to be doing initial uh, 30 grams of water and bloom it for 30 seconds. Now oh, let's do 40 gram. Let's do 43 gram there. There we go. Oh, start the timer. I like to shake a little bit, just a little shake there. And I'm gonna wait about about 40 seconds, and then I'm gonna go all the way up 300 gram. That's it. So simple. It's like one to 20 ratio. There we go. Same as well. <laughs> 290, oh my god. Okay, I should put more water. Hold on a second, guys. I do have some more water, so don't you worry. I just need an additional 10 gram here. There we go. All right, I'm just gonna do a quick stir. So you're holding the 15 gram. comes to extraction time, I'm trying to shoot for around six to seven minutes. 
because the uh, the great thing about the trickle is is this high extraction time, so you don't need as much. If you are using the V60, uh, nowadays what two and a half minutes to three minute uh, mark there with the trickleet, usually double that. So, and then you can use the the lesser, you know, you can use a less uh, uh, amount of coffee. By the way, uh, if you haven't seen from Amazon, Amazon, I saw, I've been talking about on my channel for the last few days, the fellow stack is now $109, <clears throat> and the additional $10 of the coupon code there. Right there, make sure check that mark, okay? So you're gonna get for 109, so which means you're gonna get for $99. So if you guys are looking for stack, EKG kettle, <clears throat> now is a good time to buy, okay? All right, so meantime, we're just gonna wait, okay? Just set it and forget it. By the way, I hope you guys are having a wonderful day so far. All right, so by the way, uh, thank you for joining us on the live chat there. We got who's on? We got Murphy's on, Cooker for Coffee, uh, Richard from France there. We got the uh, Sipa. Let's see who else. We got Murphy. Good. And we have our regular there. Uh, Richard say, man, 159 pounds. France, no discount. Goodness. It's $99 in US right now. Man, I'm telling you that France. So we are in the four minute mark. Okay. Obviously, the blade grinder. You know, it's, it's not consistent, okay? The blade grinder is not consistent, so it's not as, I mean, so that's why it's a little tricky. A little tricky there. And plus this coffee is like, what, six months old? But again, it's been stored on my uh, fellow, the fellow Atmos. So hopefully it's been hold, uh, held up here. I cannot wait to try it out. We are into about five minutes. <clears throat> I'm trying to shoot for around seven minutes. So. Obviously the black rind there the, is a little slower. Okay. Definitely more slow there for sure. Yeah. Where the EK is a lot more, you know, consistent, for sure. 159 euros. Okay. So what I'm gonna do is after like six minute mark, I'm just gonna. Hopefully you guys can hear us. Okay, here we go. So we got two cups here. So let's start with the blade grinder, okay? Cheers. Actually, you know what, hold on. Let's start with the EK43, okay? Let's start with the EK43. <clears throat> Definitely almond. Man, you know, I have to say, six months old still has that great tasting notes. Wow. Apple, almond, made very nice finish to it. I'm pleasantly surprised. Okay, this is good. How about blade grinder? Okay, hold on a second. Let me wash down with some water. Hopefully, you guys can hear us right now. <clears throat> Here you go. Cheers. Okay. 
Wow, forget it. <laughs> Man, okay. It's not, you cannot drink this. I mean, I thought, I thought I can, but. Oh. Wow. Hold on. So, so this is the EK-43. Wow. You have that fragrance. Now, hold on. Let me, let, let me look at my tasting note one more time. Okay. Hold on a second here. Cherry pie, almond, and apple. Wow. I mean, so this is the, like truly, you know, what the EK-43 can do, goodness. This is really nice, okay? I mean, this is, it's amazing. It's really good. I mean, but this one here is a blade grind. You know, I, I thought, man, the looks are about the same color, right? You cannot drink this. It's terrible. So, uh, what I'm trying to say for this experiment, uh, do not, I mean, I mean, don't use your blade grinder for making coffee. It's not worth it. Okay, it's not worth it. Uh, if I were you, spend a little bit more, uh, get the burr grinder. Even the hundred dollar, you know, burr grinder, the budget grinder is definitely worth getting. If you guys, you know, if you guys like, you know, coffee, you know, you're gonna enjoy more. Let's put it that way. I mean, this coffee, coffee here. I mean, this is as good as <clears throat> the coffee, you know, fresh roasted a couple weeks ago. Wow. Anyway, I hope you guys are having a wonderful afternoon. Okay, make sure don't forget to check out uh, the fellow stock if you guys are interested. I'm gonna put the link down below. I know some pe uh, some people out there complain about the flow control on this one. You're gonna see the inside, you're gonna see the flow of kind of like restrictor compared to other uh, cattle out there because they are designed to be uh, pulled slowly because um, if you are doing the pull over, you want to be precise. So that's another reason. So it's, you know, but again, the reason why I mentioned this is because it's a price. This cut is usually $160. Plus we got the $10 discount. So I mean you're looking getting for 99 bucks. So I mean if you are thinking about for a long time, I mean this is an opportunity to pick one one up for you. Anyway, I hope you guys are having a great day and see you guys tomorrow.